Hi, kindergartners. Are you ready to read our poem for this week? It's called Pick and Choose by Sydney Meltzer Kleinhens. We read Sydney Meltzer Kleinhens when we read the hedgehog poem. This is a different one. It says, I can pick a pack of soda pop, pick a pair of shoes. I can pick a peck of pickled peppers, pick a pen to use. I can pick a pile of paper clips or pick a piece of pork. I can pick a pound of pumpernickel, pick a spoon or fork. I can pick a toothpick, pick a tooth, or pick a pretty rose. I can pick a friend, but I'm polite. I'd never pick a nose. Did you get that? That was funny. Let's look and see what this poem means. First of all, that was a tongue twister. Did you see all those peas? If you rainbow write and you pick and you highlight your pea with a red crayon, you're going to have a lot of them. That's a, that's a bit of a tongue twister. Let's talk about what it means. I can pick a pack of soda pop. Soda pop is soda. They used to call it pop back a long time ago. And a pack might be a six pack of them. I can pick a pack of soda pop, pick a pair of shoes. How many is a pair? Two. I can pick a peck of pickled peppers. Do you know that rhyme? Peter Peck picked a peck of pickled peppers. A peck of pickled peppers. Pick a pen to use. I can pick a pile of paper clips or pick a piece of pork. I can pick a pound of pumpernickel. Pumpernickel is a type of bread. Pick a spoon or fork. I can pick a toothpick. Pick a tooth or pick a pretty rose. I can pick a friend, but I'm polite. Polite means you have good manners, right? I'd never pick a nose because picking your nose is bad manners. When you pick something, you know the word pick. You're choosing. You're choosing. And this poem is all about choosing different things. Let's try one more time all together. Read it with me if you can. I can pick a pack of soda pop, pick a pair of shoes. I can pick a peck of pickled peppers, pick a pen to use. I can pick a pile of paper clips or pick a piece of pork. I can pick a pound of pumpernickel, pick a spoon or fork. I can pick a toothpick, pick a tooth or pick a pretty rose. I can pick a friend, but I'm polite. I'd never pick a nose. You can take your poem and cut it out and paste it on the left side of your poetry book. On the right side, you can draw one of the things that the author picked, or you can think of your own thing to draw, something that has to do with the poem. Have a wonderful day.